Well, I'm our facts of Mars, and no playlist for this one. Robert Bigelow is the founder of Bigelow Aerospace, and he's the one who wants to build those, uh, they're like inflatable habitats uh, for orbit, and he says he's absolutely convinced that there are aliens living side by side with us here on Earth. Now, this isn't any dummy. This guy's a billionaire. Uh, you don't get to be a billionaire by being a dummy. That's why they believe in aliens. Mr. Bigelow responded, I'm absolutely convinced. That's all there is to it. There has been and is an existing presence, an ET presence on Earth. I spent millions and millions of millions probably spent more as an individual than anybody else in the United States has ever spent on the subject of aliens. Mr. Bigelow did not specify exactly how much he has spent on his research and declined to comment on any personal UFO comment uh, encounters. Correspondent Larry Logan, who was leading interviews, then asked Mr. Bigelow what he felt was risky for him to say in public what he believes about aliens. She asked him whether he worried that people might think he's crazy. Mr. Bigelow responded, I don't give a damn. I don't care. It's not going to make any difference. It's not going to change the reality of what I know. When asked whether he thought future human missions in space would result in alien encounters, he said, you don't have to go anywhere. It's just like they're right under people's noses. The entrepreneur's comments came in, come as a surprise, considering his company has worked closely with NASA in the past, which denies any evidence of aliens. Well, I got news for you, uh, uh, folks. Uh, NASA's got a lot of people who work directly for them, and who believe in aliens. And they may keep their mouths shut, but I'm sure they do. That that's my guess. There's nothing I can prove, but uh I'm thinking that's probably the case. So there you have it. Uh, another celebrity, this time big time billionaire is saying, Yep. There are aliens on Earth. I've heard estimates ranging from something like 82 species to uh, what was it? Over 100 are living here or visiting at any one time. Or, you know, currently coming and going, whatever. I believe it. I saw that one craft in uh, 2013 that that one was, a, for me, was a life-changing event because I realized, I looked at it and I realized it was not from Earth. And I realized that there's something more going on than what we've been told. That was a clincher for me. I'd already seen UFOs before that. You know, 2003, 2005. That was a clincher. I saw that thing. It was humongous. It was many times the size of a conventional airplane. No. We're not being told the truth. You won't get me to change my story either because I know what I saw. At any rate, there you go. Thanks for watching. No playlist for this one. Have a good day. Remember to check out Mars Station sometime. Uh, real research, science fiction, and the highest science fiction babes on YouTube. I'm Artifacts of Mars.